Hey there everyone, this is Argon Matrix welcoming you welcoming you I always say that so fast, like welcoming welcome welcoming welcoming you to episode twenty six of um The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Last time we did quite a lot of stuff. We had some heartfelt cutscenes and stuff. We got the Goron mask. And the last thing we did was whoa do the electric slide on the red carpet. That's great. We lit up this chandelier here. Chandelier here. Chandelier here. There you go. Now, what can you do with this, you might ask? Well, you see this little ramp here, this golden ramp of justice? Um, well, what you can do with this is you want to get into your little ball form and roll, roll, roll until the cows come home. And not try to miss that. You want to hit one of those, uh, freaking... You want to hit like the Goron faces, you know? Get your face out of my place, Goron. But yeah, you want to hit them like that. Uh, you want to hit the Goron chandelier thing on the actual bulbs or whatever that are on fire. Okay, so get your traction up on the carpet and bam, there we go. Okay, and one of these things, I'm, I, I, I don't think there's really any way to tell which one it is. But one of them is going to contain a certain item that you want to collect for a certain side quest. So that'll be useful for us. I uh, might want to move my microphone a little bit here. Sorry if this... Sorry if they made a little noise. I might just cut that out. I don't know. But I just had to move it down a little bit, I think. Okay. So, yeah, it's a bit hard to time this, too. Okay. I'm going to go forward and... Oh, this is bad. Come on, hit it! Thank you. I hit one of them, but it didn't drop anything, so... Well, at least that's another one that's clear. Okay. And we'll just roll back up to the top here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Bit of waste of magic there, but... Oh, well. Who gives a damn? Really? Okay. Now... I think we're gonna wait for these to pass here, and... Jump, jump, jump. Hit it, hit it. There we go, okay. That's the one that contains it. Thank goodness it gives me a cutscene, otherwise I might miss it entirely. But what the hell is this thing, you might ask? It's just some random rock or something that looks kind of like a pork chop. Or whatever. Well, this is actually a sirloin rock. Yep. You remember those from the previous game? Well, they, they were just mentioned in the previous game, but... Like, I, th I think they were mentioned in Ocarina of Time anyways, like... How they had to get into back into the Dongo's cavern for the sirloin rocks or something. So I believe this is a sirloin rock. This is what they were referring to. And you need to take this somewhere. And yes, this is very slow and tedious because you can't like carry it on your back while rolling or anything. I don't know why you can't because that guy in like Twilight Princess, that one Goron, can carry a barrel of water on his back while he's rolling. But I guess that mechanic is just too advanced for the N64 times. Oh well. Yeah, just avoid all the enemies as best you can. Hopefully they won't knock the socks off you or the sirloin or the sirloin rocks out of you. Okay, cross the bridge, cross the bridge, stop following me, right, Wolfles, I don't like you. You can go down a hole, in that hot spring hole, you just go drown in there, yeah, because you can drown in, like, one inch of water if you know what you're doing. Or if you don't know what you're doing, depending on your point of view. Okay, so this is where we were, want we're wanting to take this Sirloin Rock, is to the Mountain Village, because, if you recall, there is a guy over there, and he said that he was stuck up there and really hungry and cold. So, if we take this over to him, throw it up there, and... Th that's it! It's so good, I can dream about it. Uh, Donongo Cavern's finest quality rock sirloin. Okay, well... Sorla and Rock sounds better. This is my absolute favorite. Blessed be this meal. And he just nom noms away at that. Oh, my energy has returned to me. I am coming down now. Wait one moment. And boom. He comes down. What's, what's that on his head anyways? Is that a frog? Oh, I wonder who it might be. Why, if it isn't Darmani, you are alive? Yes, I see. That is the reason why you knew my favorite food. Oh, I almost forgot. Please accept this as a token of my gratitude. The Don Garo's mask? Don Giro? That's a very strange little mask. It's not really a mask at all. It's just a hat. It was crafted so well that no one would ever think twice if you were to direct the, f the, the frog choir. I hope that spring will come soon so that I can hear the frog's enthusiastic performance. Hope as I might, it's still cold. I'm going back to the Goron village. Uh, good for you, buddy. Okay, so that is that. That's how you get one of another one of the other masks that we need. 
Look at our map screen. It's filling up nicely, isn't it? This entire row is almost done. That's cool. Uh, oh, I could do something with that mask of sense now, couldn't I? I don't know. There's quite a lot of things I could do now. But, I believe what we're supposed to do now, since we pretty much explored the entire area around, like, Goron Village, there's nothing much left for us to do around there. At least not that I can think of, but there's probably something that I'm just overlooking. But, let's head out to Snowhead. Let's see what it's like out there now. Come on. Over here, this is Snowhead. Welcome. There's an ice keys up there. You know how much I hate those things. Okay. Ah. Oh, come on. God damn it. How can one little tiny ice key freeze an entire Goron? Warning, close to the general public and those who cannot perform the Goron jump. And, oh, shit. I'm running low on life. Oh, no. 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 That would have been bad. Okay. Um. You know what? I should probably go find somewhere to heal or something. But, you know what? Screw that. Let's just... Boom! Smash! Bang! Kaboom! Just pound our way through this entire place. Look at that. That was great. This one is no head temple. What's that? A temple? Uh, I believe there's, like, something out there that you can go to at some point. But I don't think we have proper items for it yet. Uh, maybe we do. I don't... No, we don't have the... Uh, spoilers, sorry. I'm not gonna tell you. Ooh, Snowhead Temple. Ooh, it's very spiky on the top there. But, yep. That's our next temple over there. Just looming in the distance. Oh, night of the first day. 60 hours remain. That's great. Okay, and there's another stone bird statue here. You wanna hit that? There you go. Okay. Um. Yep, Snowhead Temple ahead. There you go. That's the Snowhead Temple. That's the next dungeon. Wouldn't you believe it? Okay, but before we move on to there, now that we have this stone bird statue, I think I'm going to, uh, really quickly, I want to go get the Swampland title deed so I can give it to that guy in the Goron Village, and we can access another heart piece, I believe, from there. Okay, so I'm going to cut away here really quick since it's a long and tedious side quest that you've already seen me do once before. It's like you have to get the moons tier and then the, you know, like the land, the town land title deed and then like the swamp land title deed with that. So, yeah, I will meet you back at um, Goron Village, I believe. Okay, so see you in a second. Alright guys, after not too long of a time, I'm actually kind of surprised at how little time it took, I am back here at the, the Deku Scrub or Deku Merchant in a, in the Goron Village, and um, I'm as a Deku Scrub so I can give him this Swamp Land Title Deed, or Swamp Title Deed I guess. Okay, I wish you could give that to me. I'll give you this land in exchange. And we get the Mountain Title Deed. Hoorah! I'm going back, right back to the swamp. Oh yes, go to home sweet home, buddy. Oh, I'm sure you'll love it there. Hmm. Yeah, I get the point, buddy. You're flying away. I see that. Okay. Uh, good luck back in the swamp, buddy. Good friend. And you can launch up here now and grab a heart piece. Yay! That makes four... So that's a new heart container right there. That makes, what, nine hearts now? That's not too bad, actually. Uh, I, I'm sure I could have a lot more or something. Maybe even just one more at least, but... You know what? I don't feel the need to. Okay. So, now that I've done that, um... Yeah. Ooh, what the? <laughs> that was a weird... Okay. I didn't, I didn't really know that you could, like, put one mask on top of the other like that. That's kind of cool. <laughs> it just like spins away. Look at look at it go. That was awesome. Yeah, it's almost as awesome as like this. <laughs> okay. Oh, I can't have another laughing fit at that. Oh, but that is really funny. Okay. So uh, just get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. I say what the? Oh, he's spinning around too. Okay, whatever. You know what? Song is soaring. Let's just get out of here. Soar away! 
Darmani, Link, whatever you want me to call you, I don't know. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and move back up to Snowhead, which is where we obviously want to be. And I think I'm gonna end off my recording session actually up there. Uh, do I want to? How much time do I have left? I still have like five minutes left. Um, you know, before before we move on first. You want to play the Goron Lullaby here because I could have shown you with the Lens of Truth, but there's actually something invisible here that you want to put to sleep. Check this out. Giant Goron! Oh yeah. And this hypnotic spell of song can put any Goron to sleep, no matter what size. So, goodbye Mr. Guardian who's just blowing us away. Gone from suck to blow, and just fall yeah that's great okay I guess we killed that guy and now our path is clear to snowhead if we want to go there it looks rather dangerous and ominous at night doesn't it okay so you know what in the next episode we're gonna go ahead and move on with that temple so for now we're just gonna go ahead and save here save our progress and quit playing yes so thank you everyone for watching until next time this is our matrix signing out thank you and good night